The training we're going through today is called alert training. And alert training is advanced law enforcement rapid response training. And it's absolutely vital to the successful response in the event we have an active shooter on one of our campuses, on any property on the campus. It's not just the schools. It's also any property we have in the district. And it's preparing our officers to come together and respond in the event of having a crisis at one of our locations. Well, the purpose of this, the training is to do active shooter, uh, realistic type training to ensure that we're preparing our officers to respond to an active shooter if the event occurs. The key is, is the response, getting our local partners involved as well as pulling officers from other schools as a resource so that we can uh, consolidate on one particular area and neutralize the individual who's uh, perpetrating the, the offense. I, I just want to say that we're extremely excited about the opportunity. Uh, you rarely get an opportunity to pull in uh, your federal partners to give you some realistic training. And this training is not just realistic, it's from a national standard. So we're really pleased to get that type of training here in the district so that we can prepare our officers to support our children in the event this occurs in one of our uh, schools. The training doesn't just encompass our officers. We have our federal partners, we have the FBI here. We also have other jurisdictions in the area. We have our state partners and our local partners to assist. Because one must understand when you have a crisis like this, it's all hands on deck. You're calling everyone you can as a resource to come in. So it's vitally important for us to understand what the roles are, because the first people on the scene are the ones who would go in and respond to the crisis to neutralize the individual who's perpetrating the offense.